Hello, hello everyone. Hello, hello, hello. Hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. How are you feeling on this magical day of the 21st of the 12th, 2020, when the alignment of Jupiter and Saturn fully aligns uh, tonight, tomorrow night. Hello everyone, hello, welcome. Welcome, I'm really excited to be here and to be doing this with you all. Um, this planetary alignment, I just want to talk a little bit about that. So when you think about the story of Jesus's birth and the stars, the beautiful bright shining light that the three kings followed, well, it's a similar thing. It's, it's actually a similar thing. So this really is a magical, magical alignment of our planetary systems up there. Um, and I'm really excited because it feels like there's something magical going to happen once this alignment take, takes place. And Hello everyone. Hi, hi, hi. Welcome, welcome everybody. And this magical alignment, of course, we know in other realms and other dimensions, it's opening up a massive portal of higher cosmic light, which is then going to pour down into the planet and um, through Uluru, which is fantastic. And that beautiful cosmic light plasma is going to flood through the earth connecting with us all um, and really elevating the frequency of the earth and us of course and i'm just going just going to connect into our et friends i use radios to connect with them and i have two radios on the same frequency and one radio that's on a different frequency because I always know that it is something extraterrestrial or otherworldly connecting with me when two radios are on the same channel but only one radio reacts and the other one doesn't even the light doesn't even come on so I know that that is uh, beings from another dimension, if you like, making contact. On that subject, I want to just share what happened last night, because many of you have asked. So I was out, it was quite late, I think it was about half past 12 this morning or last night. And it was quite late and I always take the dogs out to do a wee last thing at night. And I'd gone out in our car park area, which is out through this window. And I was just looking up and I just, one of the radios has started, which is fantastic. And I was just looking up and I was just connecting with the stars. And it was a beautiful, beautiful, clear night. And I really opened my heart up and I just stand there and I go, if there is anyone there, can you please let me know? And as soon as I said that, there was a pure really bright streak of light that went from one part of the sky to the other then stopped went blank and then all of a sudden there was a big flash bulb right at that spot so i again really expanding my heart open and standing there and then i put my hand on my heart and i said please please come closer and i actually did that with my hand and it did it went dark, then it came closer, and then a big flash bulb. I did it again, put my hand on my heart and said, please, please come closer. I see you. Um, I'm very grateful for you to connect with me. And it came closer again. 
And I just stood there and I knew they were there. I could feel the energy, the connection. I could really feel it. It was absolutely wonderful. And then I saw it go off in another direction. So the feeling I had, especially with the second or third flashbulb, I actually felt like there was a true connection. Um, that I don't know, I mean, I, I know I'm a gatekeeper, so I can open portals, but there was definitely a connection to that craft and I could feel it. Um, I felt them come closer, which was uh, quite unusual. Um, normally I don't feel that sort of thing, but I did feel like they had come closer, even though I knew they were right up there in space. So definitely something magical happened last night which is fantastic welcome everyone thank you thank you for coming and joining me today for this beautiful beautiful magical moment of the alignment of saturn and jupiter and the opening of the cosmic portal uh bringing in some higher galactic light from the cosmos um which is going to come down through Uluru and right the way down into the earth, triggering the crystals that have been left there from a um, galactic, from our galactic star brothers and sisters, if you like, many moves ago. And these are going to be reactivated. And how amazing is that? And then this plasmic, plasma, Cosmic plasma light is going to flood through the grids in the earth. If you're in Australia, you'll perhaps say the, the song lines, um, the ley lines, the crystalline grids, whatever you want to call it, it's going to flood through and really go through the earth, um, creating the portal and the doorway to the age of Aquarius where so much higher dimensional energy and cosmic energy is going to connect with us going to it's going to trigger our dna to open more um, our light bodies to expand our soul energy to step forward into the physical more um, our third eyes to really come on board so we start interacting with the other dimensions that are here in the quantum field which is all around us or the unified field as some people call it so real magical time now on a physical level of course on the 3d human level there's lots going on still but we're not going to focus on that we're going to focus on the fifth dimensional level or uh, density and beyond so we're going up in a higher frequency and we're going to focus on that we are going to set the intention today to connect to the our brotherhood of light and the galactic federation of light and the many many star brothers and sisters that are all around in our universe at the moment keeping an eye on our sun but also around our planet keeping an eye on what's going on with us. So let's, let's start. So just take in or sit somewhere where you are comfortable or lie down if you want, just somewhere nice and comfortable for you. Close your eyes, take in a beautiful deep breath, tapping into the unconditional love that's in the quantum field that's all around us. Feeling that love from the collective as all of us today who are awakened souls who are connecting into that higher dimensional energy of love and pure light. And bringing in gratitude for all the blessings we have in our lives. And I want you to just give yourself a nice big smile just put that smile on your face and 
feel that energy and that joy. For when we smile, we automatically release beautiful endorphins, which raise our frequency up anyway. So just smiling and breathing in, taking in a deep breath and then letting go and releasing. Tapping into that unconditional love and breathing in that unconditional love. And then letting go. Breathing in again. Beautiful, unconditional love. Letting go. This music I'm playing is playing the frequency of love. allowing yourselves to feel just feel into your body feel the love and the light is now flooding through your entire cellular structure To your energy field. Still with that beautiful smile on your face and that feeling of pure gratitude and love and light. Connecting into our own heart space now. Breathing in that beautiful unconditional love again and breathe it right the way into your heart. Going through portals as your multidimensional heart opens. Connecting in and going deep now within your heart. Reaching to your soul essence through your heart space. And that knowing who you are. Feeling into your body. Feeling your heart expand. Feeling your heart expand so much it almost wants to jump out of your chest. As your heart resonance now goes out and expands out wider and wider. Going out past your house in all directions. Going out past the town or the place where you live. expanding right the way out into space now so that your heart encompasses the earth your heart resonance is so expanded that you are connected to all that is the I am of all that is the creator you hold the earth within your heart. You're going beyond that now. Through all time and space. Allow yourself now to flow through your heart space. Through your expanded awareness through your expanded heart as your heart and higher consciousness connect.
bringing your tension down into your heart. This is a powerful multi-dimensional center. Staying in this space as we call upon the God Source, the Collective, Archangels and Angels, Ascended Masters, all of our spirit guides and helpers, the spirit healers and doctors, the ancient ones and the tribal elders, the Brotherhood of Light, the Galactic Federation of Light and the High Council. The beautiful shining ones and all of the trans-dimensional and interdimensional beings that work for the betterment of the earth and humanity and all the kingdoms of the earth. We connect now through this portal in our heart space. Going through now into the fifth dimension. Where peace and unity prevail on this planet. And throughout the universe. And through this space connecting into the 3D earth. We move higher now, going up into the sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth dimension. Eleventh and twelfth. Looking, using your mind's eye and your imagination. Looking in, raising up, seeing now into the twelfth dimension. It is pure light. There are many, many light beings here in this space. It is so pure. There are many, many beings of pure light, of transdimensional, beautiful ET beings, and of course beautiful beings from the higher realms of the spirit. There are also some earth beings that are from the 13th dimension that live in our beautiful earth. There are many, many beings gathered. And now with us as we create this channel through our hearts and raise our frequency and open the portals to raise up into the 12th dimension. So there are now humans amongst these other beautiful beings as we raise up. See yourself walking through the light connecting to these beautiful beings. There are many of them. There are many races. All shapes and sizes. And there are beautiful beings that are just pure energy. And a 
you stand there in the 12th dimension, connecting into the new age of Aquarius, these beautiful beings wish to place their hands upon your heart. Do not be fearful. Allow them to just place their hands upon your heart and feel. Feel the love. Breathing in that beautiful unconditional love. And sending love back to them as well. As there is an exchange of energy. An exchange of the highest frequency. space for a moment. If there is anything you are needing, please ask now. Any healing or abundance or magic to come into your life. magical moments, your hopes, dreams and wishes. As we also set the intention now for 2021 in this space of higher frequency of pure light, and we send that light out now from our hearts, from this space in the 12th dimension, into the future, into the year 2021, and see that light permeate through everything, through all the dimensions, through right the way down to the 3D dimension through every single living thing on planet Earth, through the structures and the buildings, through the roadways, through the grids within the Earth, through the grids that are around the Earth, the crystalline grids, seeing that light now permeate through to release and transmute all negative energy. So that we fully step into the age of Aquarius as the transition from 3D to the higher dimensions where everything on earth is in harmony. There is enough food and water for everyone on this planet to live comfortably. There is enough of everything for everyone on this planet to live comfortably. 
and see the communities in the future, in 2021. Communities of people helping one another, the compassion that is throughout all of humanity for all other living creatures and for themselves. And we draw that image of everyone living in peace and harmony, compassion, love, draw that image and that connection of the, through the portal that we've opened back now down into this timeline so that from now on that pure light essence that we have opened up from our heart space will now permeate through all of us around where we are now in this dimension through into 2021 and beyond throughout planet earth throughout humanity and see the beings of light now They are very happy that we have set this intention. And now, connecting in as we come back down through the portal that we've opened through our hearts. But this time we're going to go down from our heart space down through our bodies to our solar plexus, our sacral chakra, our base chakra, down our legs, down into our knees, down our shins, down into our feet and out of the bottoms of our feet and down into the earth. Connecting on a multi-dimensional level deep within the earth to the earth's heart the earth's consciousness to the grid system of light which is within the earth the crystalline light and now we are going to travel through this gridded system to underneath Uluru and as we are in this space we can see these beautiful electric blue crystals which have been placed here from off planet by our star brothers and sisters many moons ago. And as time is just an illusion, there is no time. We now open up the portals through time and space to connect in to when the full alignment of Jupiter and Saturn takes place. We are there now seeing it. And as that alignment happens, that portal of light opens from the highest frequency in the cosmos. And traveling down through Uluru now, as many star nations, as well as humans, are stood around linking arms around Uluru. And that light now pours down in to where we are connecting into the crystals that we can see in our mind's eye, seeing them glowing now, glowing brighter and brighter and brighter. 
going from that beautiful electric blue now as the light shards come through and into the crystals. These crystals become pure white. And you can see that they are in a geometric shape underneath Uluru. And as they light up, beams of light come out each side of them in perfect alignment to create a huge network of sacred geometry that is now traveling through the earth, connecting to other crystalline points around the earth and through the earth connecting to all the mother crystals that are within the earth. And as each crystal is connected with that light, that cosmic light, that high plasma cosmic light, these mother crystals also light up and become engaged like turning on. So all of their healing energy, their healing frequencies of all the essence that they hold now also travels through that sacred geometry network of light. And as it expands out. This light now travels up all the way through the earth and around the earth, coming up now through the ground, coming to the surface, going beyond the surface and coming out now to reach beyond our atmosphere. So the earth now is in a pure bubble of beautiful cosmic plasma light. See yourself as you are a multidimensional being, both still within the crystals, where the crystals are, seeing the light pouring down still through space and coming down and into the earth, lighting those crystals. And at the same time, seeing yourself at the edge of the bubble of light that is round the earth. Because you are multidimensional, you can be in several places at the same time. bringing yourself with your consciousness as well into your home and seeing the light flooding throughout your home, going into the walls, the doors, the floors, all the furniture, the carpets, the ceiling. your whole house is filled with light. Keep yourself in this space, flitting backwards and forwards if you wish, or being fully present in that space. As I will now connect in and bring down through codes of light. And I set the intention now with the beings that I work with, that these codes and the geometries and coding that comes with them are for you personally, as this energy is intelligent in nature, so that these beautiful codes will interact with your blueprint on a personal level 
with your energy signature on a personal level, to expand the light through your light body, to fully open your cosmic heart even further than what we have opened it. And connecting your light body, your heart, your third eye, and your entire energy system with pure light and pure codes.
Ishanate Arayana Uriamaya Iranai Tiani Marati Arana Karayada Connecting in through the heart. Feeling that connection to our bra star brothers and sisters. many beings of light and the trans-dimensional beings from the higher realms. As the light pours in from the cosmos now into our hearts, into our entire bodies, feeling that light Codes pour in. Ishanate Ariamoriate Anaya Aro Nariamoya Aro Hara Yana Iranai Iro Rai Emeria Dura Iro Uru Yara Gira Nere Gira Tutu Kashika Kateata Iro から Connecting in to all the feminine, the Bon Ying, Mother Mary, Mary Magdalene, birthing in the age of Aquarius, birthing in the feminine. feminine and masculine have equal balance within each one of us. Feeling their love.
taking in a beautiful deep breath. heart that's been fully activated, feeling that love and expansion, but also feel that anchoring to the earth. As we leave now those channels of consciousness open, that they are fully anchored so that you may reconnect in with any of the beings that we that have been here today, that have connected with us today. You may take your yourself to that space under Uluru where those beautiful glowing crystals are, or out into space and look at the earth and that beautiful bubble of light. Or if you wish, take yourself to another time, another dimension, another space. As your consciousness now has been activated and opened. Don't worry if you're getting any head pressure. It's all normal as there are new neural pathways that are opening to a new higher level of consciousness. And the codes that have come in and are still coming in to your beingness, to your bodies, to all your bodies, that's your physical, your emotional, your mind, your light body and your soul body. And this will carry on activating Remembering is, is intelligent, coded frequency. You might even feel a very mild vibration running through your cells. This is a step up to a higher level of frequency where your immune system will be on top four, where your light will be shining out, your consciousness and awareness be more expansive, and that connection to the higher realms, to that twelfth dimension is open. Feeling now yourself anchored into the earth. And that light is still pouring in through Uluru, lighting those crystals. And that will carry on for the next three days. It is opening and birthing the channels to the age of Aquarius on this beautiful solstice day. For here, us here in New Zealand, it is the longest day of the year. And for you beautiful beings that the other side of the planet, it is the shortest. For you, it is the winter solstice. For us, it is our summer. Just visualize in your mind the grids that have now awakened the song lines, the dragon lines through the earth, connecting to all the mother crystals, creating that coded light sacred geometries for our beautiful mother Gaia. 
and for us and for all beings whether in this dimension or another that live on this earth but it is on this day also that the veils are thinner so it is easier for us to connect with other beings So allowing yourself now to come back fully into your body, still with an expanded heart. Coming back in. Please, please feel free to share this. Please also listen to it at a later date uh, I'm going to put up the heart the cosmic heart activation design that I did recently for this event uh, I'm going to put that up on the event page and probably my Facebook page as well so if you wish to print it off, you can place it under your pillow, under your bed, so that the beautiful energies from it can also interact with you and it can keep going. So I'm going to close for now. Well, actually I did pull some cards for this beautiful event. So this card, I don't know if you can see it very well, beautiful imagery on this card. We mustn't forget that our waters on this planet are going to be vibrating with pure light and the beautiful beings that live in the waters are also going to be activated. Remember joy, love, happiness. This is also an opening of all your psychic abilities, your intuitive abilities. And of all the hard work that you've done over the years, give yourself a pat on the back and many blessings for you for doing everything that you've done, both on a physical 3D level, but also on a higher level of consciousness. Stand up for yourself and your beliefs. Have confidence to move forward. And the wheel, a fresh new start and the end of the old. Sudden or unexpected progress beautiful positive changes coming into your life. So I am going to close now. I wish you all lots and lots of love. Please share this. If you would like to know more about what I do and what I offer, please go to my website, which is www.ginnyjoneshealing.com. Thank you so much for joining me here today on this major cosmic event. It's not going to happen again now in this alignment for another 400 years. And the last time this powerful alignment happened was 400 years ago. So it truly is a magical, magical time over these next few days and the lead up to Christmas. And you know, if we think about, um, Christmas and the birth of Jesus and the star of Bethlehem. Well, we have our own star in this timeline, which is leading the light, leading us all to the light. If you like, we're all the wise men and we're all being led to the light. So much love, a wonderful day, absolutely fantastic Christmas holiday season enjoy if you're over the other side of the world from me 
snuggle up warm, keep warm and enjoy all the festivities and the food and family. And if you're here on this side of the world, um, we are going to go to the beach on Christmas morning and we're going to have breakfast on the beach. Uh, so we will be going swimming and breakfasting on the beach and sitting in the sun and just enjoying time with family. And it is a time to come together. Never forget that. Much love. Take care. Bye for now. Bye.